Area's first summer camp opened with a new field, no swimming, no field trips. Instead, new measures are in place because of the COVID-19 pandemic. Tony Galley reports from Fitchburg on how that did not get in the way of fun. In many respects, this first day of camp in this summer looks a lot like summers in the past. But before these children all gathered together to make their ice cream, there were temperatures that had to be taken. Health histories reviewed with their parents. Their counselors also going through those same checks as precautions stand side by side with playfulness. This is day one of your work. Yep, this is my first work experience since the, the lockdown happened. And without kids having school, uh, or at least virtual school, they aren't getting the social interaction with other kids. Every counselor has like a group of 12 kids that we have to stay with all summer. Within the groups, um, we are not enforcing social distancing just because these kids are with each other all day for the entire day and they don't see any other kids or counselors throughout the day. Heaven forbid someone did uh, spread the disease, we want to limit the impact that that would have on a group. Washing hands like three, four times a day. Yeah, I think it's been a real testament to the Y brand uh, that people did feel so comfortable putting their kids in camp. <laughs> Are you over the nerves and have you started bonding with your group? Yeah, I think so. For camp to be successful, you do have to check all the boxes and not lose sight of the pandemic as the children go through their day. In Fitchburg, Tony Galley, 27 News. The YMCA camp and other camps set to open are working with city, county and state health officials to ensure best practices to decrease chances of any coronavirus transmission.